Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to look at the Sennheiser E604 instrument microphones. I think these are marketed as instrument mics, but typically you hear about people using them on drums, and that's what I use them for, so that's the application that we're going to check out today. Now, I kind of use them in a little unconventional way. Uh, I'll show you guys that here in a second. Um, but I just want to say that um, on the kick drum, I'm using a Shure Beta 52A, so there's no Sennheiser in there. Uh, I'm using a Sennheiser E604 on the snare, the two rack toms, and the floor tom. Uh, so I'll play you guys some sound examples of like no post-processing, and then I'll do some with some EQ and some compression and we'll just kind of go back and forth. So let me show you guys how I have these placed on the drums. So you guys can see I got my drone mics on microphone stands with booms. This isn't ideal like in a live setting, but for recording, you know, like studio work and stuff, uh, you can get away with it easier. Now the reason I do this is because you can move the drum mic in a little bit more than you can with the bracket that comes with these microphones. So it kind of gives more of a focused sound on what I'm actually going for. Uh, it's not picking up so much cymbal noise or noise from other drums or anything or any of the snare rattle. Uh, so they're kind of moved in a little bit more. You can see I even have them marked like where I want them. And um, you know, they're not so far in that they're in my way for playing, but uh, it is kind of nice having them moved in a little bit more. There you guys have it again, that is the Sennheiser E604 microphones, using them on drums, what they sound like on drums. Uh, you can use them for like, you know, guitars or whatever you want, but I like to use them for the drums. Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you haven't already, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. You guys have a great one. I'll see you next week.